Fortunately, I won't be going anywhere for a little while because um, I will be part of a brand new Broadway show right here in town. <laughs> It is a, a wonderful new musical. It's written by uh, the four phenomenal writers, and some of them are actually here tonight. Uh, James Allen Ford and Sarah Wordsworth, and I, I see you in the dark summer, Russell Kaplan, and the amazing Kristen Lopez, who wrote, who wrote, who's one of the co-writers of Frozen. So if anybody has kids who were sick of hearing it, that's who to blame. That's who to blame right there. No, I'm kidding. But, um, but, it's, uh, but um, I'm so excited to be part of this brand new original musical. Um, it's a musical that is, uh, takes place in New York City, and it's about New Yorkers, and how, um, you know, we're often in transit, and we're often going off to places and on our way somewhere, but I think the mu what the musical tries to do is it tries to get you to stop for a bit and realize where you are sometimes, that sometimes you don't have to always be in transit, that where you are is exactly where you should be sometimes in life. And um, it also has the, 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 wonder, the other wonderful part about this musical is that it's Broadway's first a cappella musical. So all of the actors on stage are actually making every sound in the show, and the vocal arrangements are, are done by uh, the incredible Deke Sharon, who did all of the vocal arrangements for the Pitch Perfect movies. Um, so if you guys are fans of Pitch Perfect, if you guys are fans of Frozen, I think you guys should definitely come and see In Transit. Um, now, I know this show is called uh, Songs For You, but um, actually, the four of them actually wrote a song for me in the show. Um, and um, I, 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 maybe I'm speaking out of turn here, but I actually sang that first song that I sang tonight, hand in hand, at my audition for In Transit. And, um, and so they, and, it's a, and I told, you know, I, I, I sang a song, and, and I think they knew what it was, what it was intended for, that it was a proposal song. And, um, and so, my character, which has never had a song in the musical before, now has this brand new song. Um, and, uh, it's, uh, I, and I also get to be engaged to the wonderful, dreamy, uh, uh, dreamy Justin Guarini in the musical as well. He plays my fiance in the show. Um, his, his character's name is Trent, and he uh, comes from a very conservative home in the South. Um, I come from a much more liberal upbringing. My character is Stephen. And, um, we are engaged to be married, but he has yet to tell his mother that he, that I am not his roommate. <laughs> and um, so I, I push him to, to tell her the truth, and I think I push a little hard. And um, this is a song that I sing to him afterwards. And it's a, it's a, it, this is a world premiere. We've actually, this song has never been heard before. No one's so. ever heard it. No one's ever heard it. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> And, uh, it's, it's scary, it's scary and I'm a little nervous that you guys are here, but um, but we like to share it with you all now, and they're going to be taking notes and making changes. <laughs> <laughs> I figure I got nothing to lose because it's not going to tell us, so this part's going to be. <laughs> Better or worse 
your home to me and I promise I'll always be home to you